India's national insignia, India's national flag. India's national flag is a horizontal tricolor of deep saffron, kesari, at the top, white in the middle and dark green at the bottom in equal proportion. The ratio of width of the flag to its length is 2-3. In the center of the white band is a navy blue wheel which has 24 spokes. Its diameter approximates the width of the white band. Its design is taken from that of the wheel, which appears on the abacus of the lion capital of Ashoka at Sarnath. Meaning of three colors of national flag. The saffron stands for courage, sacrifice, and the spirit of renunciation. The white stands for purity and truth, and the green for faith and fertility. Adoption of National Flag Tricolor flag was first accepted by Indian National Congress in 1931. It had Chalkha in the center of the white band, which was later replaced by wheel taken from Sarnath Asuka Pillar. The design of the national flag was adopted by the Constituent Assembly of India on 22nd July 1947. In the Constituent Assembly, Dr. Rajendra Prasad was the head of the ad hoc committee on national flag. The flag was designed by Pingli Venkia. Flag Code of India the Flag Code of India, 2002, has taken effect from 26 January 2002 and supersedes the Flag Code, as it existed. The Flag Code of India, 2002 is an attempt to bring together all such laws, conventions, practices and instructions for the guidance and benefit of all concerned. As per current norms, there is no restriction on the display of the national flag by members of general public, private organizations, educational institutions, etc., except to the extent provided in the Emblems and Names, Prevention of Improper Use, Act, 1950, and the Prevention of Insults to National Honor Act. 1971 and any other law enacted on the subject. Bureau of Indian Standards is in charge of enforcement of the standards of the Indian tricolor as per the provisions of the Flag Code of India. State Emblem The state emblem depicts four lines standing back to back. It is an adaptation from the Sarnath Lion capital of Ashoka, near Varanasi in Uttar Pradesh. Carved out of a single block of polished sandstone, the capital is crowned by the wheel of the law, Dharma Chakra. The Lion capital was erected in the 3rd century BC by Ahsoka to mark the spot where Buddha first delivered his sermon. In the state emblem, adopted by the Government of India on 26 January 1950, only three lines are visible, the fourth being hidden from view. The four lines symbolizing power, courage, and confidence rest on a circular abacus. The abacus is girdled by four smaller animals. Guardians of the four directions, the lion of the north, the elephant of the east, bull of the west, and horse of the south. You can remember this by analogy newsily bh. The abacus rests on a lotus in full bloom, exemplifying the fountainhead of life, and creative inspiration. The words Satyamev Jayate, meaning truth alone triumphs, 
from Mundaka Upanishad are inscribed below the abacus in Devanagari script. The use of the state emblem of India as the official seal of the government of India is regulated by the state of India Prohibition of Improper Use Act 2005 National Anthem The song Jana Danamana composed originally in Bengali by Rabindranath Tagore was adopted in its Hindi version by the Constituent Assembly as the National Anthem of India on Tuesday, 24th January 1950. Rabindranath Tagore wrote it at the request of his intimate friend Ashutosh Chaudhary, a judge of the Calcutta High Court, for singing at the 26th session of the Indian National Congress on 27th December 1911 at the Calcutta session of the Indian National Congress. Playing time of the full version of the national anthem is approximately 52 seconds. A short version consisting of the first and last lines of the stanza, playing time approximately 20 seconds, is also played on certain occasion. Apart from Indian National Anthem Rabindranath Tagore has written National Anthem of Bangladesh, Amar Sonar Bangla, and also the lyrics of Sri Lanka's National Anthem, Sri Lanka Matha. Tagore had written the music and lyrics for Nama Nama Sri Lanka Matha in the Bengali language for his student Ananda Samrakun. National Song The song Vande Matram, composed in Sanskrit by Bankim Chandra Chatterjee, was incorporated in his famous novel Ananda Math, 1882. It has an equal status with the national anthem. Later the song was set to tune by Rabindranath Tagore, and sat for the first time before the gathering at the 12th annual session of the Indian National Congress held in 1896 in Calcutta. It was declared as the National Song in 1937 through a resolution. The English translation of the stanza was rendered by Sri Aurobindo. National Calendar The national calendar is based on the Saka era with Chaitra being its first month. It consists of 365 days in a normal year. It was adopted from 22nd March 1957 along with the Gregorian calendar for the following official purposes, Gazette of India. News broadcast by All India Radio, calendars issued by Government of India, and government communications addressed to the members of the public. Dates of the national calendar correspond with those of the Gregorian calendar. Thus, the first day of Chaitra corresponds to 22nd March in a normal year and 21st March in leap year. National Animal The tiger, Panthera tigris, Linnaeus, is the national animal of India. It is a rich-colored, well-striped animal with a short coat. The combination of grace, strength, power has earned the tiger great respect and high esteem. Out of eight races of the species known, the Indian race, the Royal Bengal Tiger, is found throughout the country except in the northwestern region and also in the neighboring countries, Nepal, Bhutan and Bangladesh. National Bird The Indian Peacock, Pavo Cristatus, the national bird of India, is a colorful, swan-sized bird, 
with a fan-shaped crest of feathers, a white patch under the eye and a long, slender neck. The male of the species is more colorful than the female, with a glistening blue breast and neck and a spectacular bronze-green trail of around 200 elongated feathers. The female is brownish, slightly smaller than the male and lacks the trail. National Flower Lotus, an aquatic plant of nymphia with broad floating leaves and bright fragrant flowers that grow only in shallow waters, is India's national flower. It is a sacred flower and occupies a unique position in the art and mythology of ancient India and has been an auspicious symbol of Indian culture since time immemorial. National Fruit Mango, Marigifera Indica, is the national fruit of India. Mango is one of the most widely grown fruits of the tropical countries. In India, Mango is cultivated almost in all parts, with the exception of hilly areas. Mangoes have been cultivated in India from time immemorial. The poet Kalidasa sang of its praises. Alexander savoured its taste, as did the Chinese pilgrim Hein Zhang. Akbar planted one lakh mango trees in Darbhanga, known as Lucky Bag. National Tree Banyan tree is India's national tree. It's a member of Mulberry family. The Mulberry family is known as Morrissey, and this plant grows in India, Bangladesh, and some other countries. The banyan tree begins its life as epiphyte on a host tree, gathers nourishment and water from air, not the host. Despite being an epiphyte, the ficus is an example of a strangler fig. Its roots grow down and around the stem of the host, their growth accelerating once the ground has been reached neck after time. The roots coalesce to form a pseudo trunk, eventually strangling and killing the host. National Aquatic Animal The Gangetic Dolphin, Platonista Gangetica, is the national aquatic animal of India. It is listed by the IUCN as endangered on their red list of threatened species. The decision to declare the Ganges River Dolphin India's national aquatic animal was taken October 5, 2009 during the first meeting of the newly constituted National Ganga River Basin Authority. Details about Ganges River Dolphin are located here. National Currency Symbol the symbol is an amalgam of Devanagari Ra and the Roman capital R with two parallel horizontal stripes running at the top representing the national flag and also the equal to sign. The Indian rupee sign was adopted by the Government of India on 15th July 2010. The symbol of Indian rupee signifies India's international identity for money transactions and economic strength. The symbol, conceptualized and designed by Udaya Kumar, a postgraduate in design from Indian Institute of Technology Bombay, has been chosen from thousands of concept entries received by the Ministry of Finance through an open competition among resident Indian nationals. National Heritage Animal The Indian elephant, Elephas maximus indicus, has been declared as the national heritage animal by the government in order to conserve its dwindling population.
60% of the Asian elephants live in India. There are over 25,000 elephants in the country, including 3,500 in captivity in zoos and temples, particularly in southern and northeastern parts of the country. Indian elephant has been listed as endangered by IUCN as the population has declined by at least 50% over the last three generations. National Game The Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports of India clarified that, officially, the country does not have a national game, no game, including hockey, has been notified as such. However, many sources, including the Indian government's official portal, mention hockey as a national game. India has won eight Olympic gold medals for hockey.